It changed me. Bodybuilder known as Freakenstein reveals exactly what he saw when he died for one minute. I, I woke up in the hospital and as I was up, you know, the doctors told me that, you know, we had to revive you. You were, you know, you, you, were, you were legally dead for one minute. Yeah, legally, legally dead for one minute. Paul Dillette, a former bodybuilder renowned by the monikers Freakenstein and Jurassic Paul, has recounted a remarkable encounter during a moment of clinical death. He described a profound experience where he briefly glimpsed his dog in open space and it looked blue. This event transpired after a minute of being clinically deceased. I had a, I had a dog, and her name was Annabelle, and um, I didn't even know that I was gone. I felt like it was, I was in an open space and it just all looked blue and it looked like I was it's almost like I was standing on glass and my dog was probably about 30 feet away from me. What I experienced was just, it's, I don't know if it was just like I'm up in the sky, up in the clouds and it just seemed blue and clear and uh, all I saw was my dog that had passed away, you know? And I'm, I'm calling her to come to me, but she wouldn't come to me and, and I wouldn't go to her. Paul Dillard, who retired from the world of bodybuilding in 2012, following his departure from the sport, he ventured into new endeavors, notably founding the World Beauty Fitness and Fashion Competition in 2007, showcasing his versatility and entrepreneurial spirit beyond the realm of bodybuilding. Recounted the incident when his heart stopped during the 1994 Arnold Classic event. Dillett, a Canadian athlete, earned the nickname Freakenstein due to his extraordinary bodybuilding prowess. Paul Dillett, a former world-class bodybuilder, has undergone a remarkable transformation since retiring from the sport. He recently shared his insights into his time as a bodybuilder during the 1990s, a period when bodybuilding enjoyed immense popularity in a truly astonishing turn of events. Paul Dillett experienced a harrowing episode when he briefly passed away on stage during the 1994 Arnold Classic competition at the tender age of 29. During this distressing moment, it took the efforts of four individuals to carry him off the stage. Fortunately, thanks to the swift response of medical professionals, he was successfully revived and his life was spared. However, in the aftermath of this near-death experience, Dillard has candidly expressed that he came perilously close to losing his life that fateful day. During the event, while attempting a double biceps pose, he suffered muscle spasms that culminated in his collapse. Dillett explained during a 2021 interview with the Generation Iron Fitness and Bodybuilding Network that the incident was partly attributable to an imbalance of calcium and magnesium in his body. He emphasized how near he came to losing his life that fateful day, revealing the struggle of medical professionals to administer an IV due to severe dehydration. In that critical moment, Dillett described a surreal sensation of being in a vast, blue-tinted space where he spotted his dog roughly 30 feet away. Despite the intensity of the experience, he grappled with the desire to reach out to his dog, tempered by an understanding that he could not. Reflecting on his athletic career, Dillett portrayed the world of sports as exceedingly demanding, particularly for young athletes who often harbor a sense of invincibility disregarding potential consequences in their relentless pursuit of victory. He stressed the overpowering drive to win at any cost, overlooking limitations. Despite the harrowing incident, Dillett pressed on in competition for another two decades. However, the memory of that day continued to haunt him. Reports from muscular development revealed that he experienced cramping even before the event commenced, hinting at the challenges he would face. Even during the event, as his muscles seized during the double biceps pose, he initially downplayed the severity, attempting to reassure the audience. The aftermath was chaotic, with Dillett screaming in distress as marshals and medics rushed to his aid. Weighing 270 pounds, he was promptly stretchered off the stage and rushed to the hospital for urgent medical attention. Despite this terrifying incident, Dillett achieved significant milestones in his career including a victory at the International Federation of Bodybuilding and Fitness Night of Champions event in 1999. Moreover, he established the World Beauty Fitness and Fashion Competition in 2007. At 57 years old, Paul Dillett's appearance has significantly evolved from his competitive bodybuilding days, presenting a striking contrast to his former physique. During his prime, Dillett boasted an impressive 150 kilo frame, 
characterized by immense biceps, broad shoulder muscles, and a sculpted six-pack, showcasing the epitome of a bodybuilder's physique. However, in his current phase of life, his physique has transitioned to a more typical and moderate form, deviating from the extraordinary musculature of his youth. So, subscribe to Bodybuilding Beast Motivation and hit the bell icon. Also, like and share this video.